Hello everybody, today we're in Obelisk Fear and I'll be showing you how to do for Warrior class. Now I thought I would make this video because this is one trick to being a warrior. What even the tutorial don't show you. And the trick makes a warrior pretty much uh, one of the best classes on the game. I mean in terms of being able to solo Animus, it's really good. And before I knew this trick, I was like, well, yeah, I don't want to play that. You get your ass kicked so easy. So, first things first, I'll show the basics, and then I'll show the trick. So, the basic thing you need to know before you can even start playing a warrior is you have two different shields, the small one and the big one. The small one I've killed AF here makes it so you do more damage with your sword. The bigger one makes it so you have more defense. Both will work. I prefer to do more attack than defense, but it's up to the person. So we go to the warrior combos. As you can see, this, all these combos. Now, it's good to practice on the dummies until you get used to it. Even I can only do prefer and ruined off manly real easy so i just will stick to these two but ham stun and cleave are good as well so basically what you want to do for focus when you tank him for other people so if you're in a party you want to know how to prefer so prefer is just left right up and then wound is left right left up left right that's my best one so if I'm so in an enemy, I'll use wound. And then hamstring is up, right, left, up. Cleave, right, up, up, left. Now, for default plus, I've said these combos will probably not change. However, for stuff they do, might. So to begin with, I would master prefer, so left, right, up, and wound, left, right, left. All right. And the good thing about Perfocus, once you get to level 5, your Perfoc combo heals you a small amount. And if you're fighting low level monsters, I just run below your level. You can, if you keep using Perfoc, you're invincible for getting on you. That's cool. Alright, so you, you probably already know all this stuff. This is the easy stuff, you know, doing for combos. Easy. I'm going to show you the best part of being a warrior now. So the best part is, once you've done your combo, so for example, wound, so you do, you just say you're on left, up, left, right. So you've done that. What you want to do then is you want to block the enemy with your shield. And this is the most important part. For sword, after you've done your combo, you put it behind your head. So I, as if you're like putting it where you're drawing it out, so you put it there, but you don't let go, you ho keep holding onto the sword. And then after like three seconds, it'll retask the combo, and then you, all you need to do is hit on once, and repeat. All right, so that might sound a bit complicated, but in I'll show you exactly how to do it now, so watch closely. All right, let's see if I can get an enemy by itself. The only problem with playing warriors, if you attack one enemy and there's enemies around it, you have to fight them all. And it's a pain in the ass. I mean, once you get good at this, you can take down two enemies. Easy, but... Just because I want to show you how to do it, I just want to get one. Alright, here we go. So what you want to do is... So you do your sealed best to begin with. Then you do your combo. Hold... See where my sword is behind my head? And now can you see the little red part at the top of the sword? That means that the combo is tasked. Alright. Bam. See that? Oh, easy work. I'm only left for right, so he's a pretty hard for left for right. And as you can see, once you've done the combo once, you can keep putting it behind your head and it will task. So as you can see, it's red. That means the wound, wound combo is tasked up. And as you can see, it's gone gone away now. So you have the time limit to how many times you can do it. But it works for all combos. 
not just ruined. That's the main part thing. So I'll do it again and I'll show you for preferred combo this time. Right, come here. I don't think I did it at the time. Oh yeah, I did. Alright, so as you can see, I preferred him. And as you can see at the top, it's blue. That means it's tasked up for preferred. So, it activates just doing it once. Alright, let's see if I can do the other combo. So like I said, I don't well, normally do the other ones. Alright, so that's hamstring. That's a big green now. Can you see it green? That means... It's now hamstring. I'm going to try doing view for one. So that's. So I've done cleave. I put the sword behind my head again. And as you can see, it's gone to a different color now. That's cleave. So if I go and attack this guy, that's up. As you can see, automatically just cleave. I've just got the sword behind my back again. Cleave. Sword behind my back. Block his attacks. Cleave. That's it. Eh. All right. I'm gonna show you if I choose some for warrior class. Eh. All right, as you can see, you know, free animus, but your your combo still activated. As you can see, one on one. Easy, you can defeat enemies two levels above you. Easy as pie. Two enemies, as long as they're the same level, you should have no problem. And then, that's just it. If you're in a team, this is even more useful. You know, you got your perfect. Just... So, one last time, the main point of this is you do the combo. All you need to do is do it once. And then, after the combo, without hitting them again, if you hit them after the combo, it won't work. So, you do your combo, it activates, your sword goes behind your back. You hold it, you block the enemy attack, and then after three seconds, it'll be tasked up. You hit them, hit only once, so you hit them once. If you hit them twice, you'll have to do the combo again. If you hit them once, all you need is put the sword behind your back, block the attack. Hit on ones. Alright, that's all you have to do. Easy as that. And if you do this properly, you'll be a world class warrior. And it'll be one of the best classes. So, one last time. Right, so, bass. Alright, that's how easy it is. Alright, see? Another guy's come up. Uh, you, th you thought you could ambush me? No, I'm a warrior fucker. I'll take you down in three hits. See so yeah, that? Three hits. Swords behind my back. Enough for combo. All you need to do it is do it once. I mean, you can keep doing it because it's it can work out faster. But if you do it this way, you can block cam every time. I haven't tried it with a big seal, it might even be better with a big seal. Alright, so that's it. Thanks for watching. I might do some other classes and stuff. I just wanted to do it because no one really knew. I only found out because I saw it on Discord once. And it really helped me. Hope it helped you. Farewell.